experience with the way it was before, and it was so unorganized and disorganized that I didn't want anything to do with it. Our usual procedure is the night before we get out all the uniforms, um, and it would usually take us a good two hours at least carrying everything out, and now just with this, we can get them done, and it usually takes about 45 minutes if that. It was really hard to storm where they were just kind of shoved in there so they got like bent in all the weird positions and now that we've got them they can all sit, they have their spot and they're all sitting the same way and it's not getting them all bumped out of shape and they're staying, keeping their original form and all that so it does work as this season we didn't have anywhere near as many shoulder pads that need to be reconditioned as usual. Or we have recruits on our recruiting days when we come in and give them tours. Now we'll actually bring them in and show them the room, whereas before we just kind of walk by the door and say, oh, there's our equipment room. You know, it's nothing they haven't seen before. Now it's a point of emphasis where we'll stop in and say, see, we do do the renovation stuff here, everything we try to keep up to date with the latest and everything, and we've got this really nice equipment room. It's like the gloves that we have for the guys and everything, when they, a lot of them will come on game days to ask for them and stuff. Well, now they're all arranged by size, they're easier to get to. I think it makes the parent, parents feel good too that everything is being taken care of so that they don't have to worry that, okay, they're getting faulty equipment, we can see it stored right. Uh, there is room for expansion. We've got, whereas the way everything's designed around here, there's actually, we've got extra space now so we can get more supplies of stuff we need where we won't run out as quick as we may have before. say we're in love with the way it is. It's so much better than it was in a year and